This tutorial will cover both single and triple knot. This is ideal for hair of any texture, with the shortest layer hitting the top of the ears or longer. You're going to need a few hair clips, about six bobby pins, and freshly brushed, though slightly dirty hair, and wine. We're going to start with the single knot. First, create a section on top by placing your index fingers at your high recession. Go back with your fingers, creating a U-shaped parting that goes all the way back to just below the curve of your head. Pull your hair up and twist it all the way up until your hair starts to coil in on itself. Wrap the hair around itself, creating the shape you desire. You can be done here, but I like mine loose and imperfect, so I hold my hair with my fingers, but let it loosen up in my hands to create a little more volume. Secure the ends of the hair with a bobby pin, pushing it through at a diagonal. Make an X with another bobby pin. If it's not tight enough, add more bobby pins until it feels secure. And there you have it, a simple but beautiful bun. The try knot is similar, but there are three buns instead of one. The first step is the same as the single knot, creating a U-shaped parting. Since there is a triple knot, you need three sections. Create the front section, which is the smallest, a few inches back from the hairline, and clip it. Split the last section in half, clip the hair back out of the way. Take the front section and twist the bangs back, then push it forward for volume. Bobby bend this piece into place. Take the ends and twist them up into the bun. Use another bobby pin to create an X, locking the hair into place. If you have flyaways, just wrap them around the base and secure with another bobby pin. Go on to the middle section and repeat. Take all the hair and pull it up and twist it until it twists itself into a bun. I prefer an off-center bun, but it's up to you. Choose your own adventure. If you keep the hair really tight, you'll have a little bun. But if you let it loosen up a bit in your hands, you'll get more volume. Once it's looking how you want it, create an X with the bobby pins. Repeat the process for the final knot. Center this one again and twist it into place. Loosen this bun up a little bit for some volume. Make an X with the bobby pins. With the leftover hair, you can give it a beachy look with sea spray or curl it and use a little hairspray. And there you have it, in the famous words of Russell Westbrook, why not try not?